Hi folks, um, I'm just going to make a quick short video. If you've just installed VersaWorks 6 or any other version and you have this message, printer not connected, then I'll show you how to get the software to recognize a printer. So first of all, we're going to find out our network on the uh, computer so if you go to your search yours will be slightly different uh, go to the command prompt so at the bottom I put CMD and then it pops up here and then I click open and then here I'll just type in IP config IP config that's just I P C O N F I G and then press enter and then here you'll get your network and ethernet um, settings are showing up so um, this is the number you're looking for the IPv4 address so this is 10 0, 0, 23. and then if you go to your uh, printer I've got a SP540i, you click menu, you go through until you find system info, then you press the right button several times, uh, hold on, oh, so yeah, so you go to system info and then the model and then press the up button you'll see the network then press the right and then you'll see IP address press the right button again and if you notice um, the IP address on the computer is 10.0.0.23 which also translates to 010.000.000 two three so I don't know why this says one two three but we're going to change it what you want to do is I'm going to change this our number on there is 23 so I'm going to change the one on the computer I don't know how it works or why it works I'm going to keep the 10 z triple zero triple zero I'm going to change this last number to 22 so I'm going to shift across you'll see the cursor move across and then I'm going to keep my finger on the down button till I get to the number 22 I'm going to press enter and then I'm just going to press the menu again and then if this is going to say processing now we're going to go back up to the computer. We're going to close all this out. For some reason, that's got to be the number on the computer's got to be different. On the printer, sorry, has to be different. Um, VersaWorks is already running, so I'm going to open it. And if you see straight away, the printer has been recognized. So uh, I'm going to go to printer, printer settings. Mm. Nothing's happening. But anyways, you get the gist of it. Um, so that's how you get the computer to recognize a printer.